Hello Zebrahead and welcome to Super Lucky's Tale. This actually released I think yesterday or the other day. It is a cute little 3D platformer. I know that the original Lucky's Tale, because this is a sequel, the original Lucky's Tale was a VR exclusive game. I don't think I'm gonna be doing a full series on this game, but I wanted to play at least one video on it to see how it is, because it looks fun to me. That really seems like something I'd be interested in trying out, and hopefully you'll be interested in seeing it. So let's get started with Super Lucky's Tale. Oh, oh, what's happening? It's a book. Luckily, I can read. This is the story of Lucky, a carefree young fox who lived in the forest. He's also my younger brother. Aw. Growing up, more than anything else, we wanted to be guardians. Heroic foxes who traveled far and wide in search of adventure. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. <laughs> He's fishing. As I returned home from my most recent adventure, I had no idea that Lucky was about to begin his own. Whoa, oh no, she's crashing. Is she gonna be all right? Oh no. After an exhausting search, I had finally found it. The Book of Ages. The book could open doors to strange new worlds. It even had the power to rewrite history but I wasn't the only one looking for it. It was the dreaded kitty litter, a dysfunctional <laughs> family litter. of cuddly criminals led by their father, Jinx. Give me the book, Guardian, or I shall take it from you. The kitty litter advanced, and I stood my ground, ready to fight. But it turned out that the book had other ideas. In a flash, Lucky sacrificed himself to save me, my little brother. Lucky and the kitty litter had been swept into the book and the worlds within, and the future of our own world was now in danger. Lucky, if you can hear me, only you can stop them now. That's a cool premise. Usually it's just like, oh yeah, we have to save this person or we, you know, like have to go and do this. It seems a little bit different, which I like. Come on. Okay, here we go. Oh, he's so cute. I love his little cape. So I don't know how to play. Perfect, wait, I thought you were a bad guy. Perfect timing. I am Master Mittens of the Miao Lin Temple. We are destined to fight, but you are no match for a teacher of the Mushu art. To prove yourself worthy, you must pass the trials I require of all of my students. Only then shall we fight, until that time, I vanish. So the guy doesn't seem to be all that bad. <laughs> okay. I mean, we're still supposed to fight him. Look at his little shimmy. We need 10, oh, lucky clovers. I get it. Oh. Golem Gateway, or Golem Getaway. Interesting. This is actually looking pretty cool. I love the graphics so far. I'm playing this on PC. Lucky. Oh, Lucky, you've risked your life to save me. I'm safe, thanks to you. Before Jinx stole the Book of Ages, it was our family's duty to protect it, but now the pages won't open for me. I can't join you on your adventure, but I'll try to slip some helpful things uh, for you between the pages. For now, focus on unsealing the locked doors and kicking Master Mittens out of there. You'll need to collect Lucky Clovers to break the lock on his door. P.S. You're on your own path to becoming a hero, Lucky. You can do this. I believe in you. Love, Liran. Now, like I said, I didn't play the original, so I don't know if this is like actually a direct sequel, but I know it's a different game. Okay, can I run? I can't, but what is this? Oh, it's a one-up. <laughs> hey, so I have... Some hearts, I have so six lives, seven coins. Hi, bunnies. You can press A to jump around. I got a bit of a double jump. The camera's a little weird. Swipe everything. That, the camera's not locked, but it definitely sort of has like a guiding camera. Oh, can I? Oh, hey, look at that. I found a secret already. Uh, how do I get up? Oh, just with a double jump. Oh, wow, look at that. Okay, so I found a couple more coins, Aaron. This is really nice. Whoa, whoa, I can get way, way up here. I don't know if that's intended. Uh, bro in the dirt. Oh. Look at that, so on little muddy spots like this, I guess I can burrow underground. Oh hey, you had a big old coin too. Hmm, so I wonder if there's like certain things I can do to get extra coins and what coins will do. Not sure right now, but I can press, oh look at this. So if there really is like maybe an extra secret somewhere, maybe I should turn around. 
if I can. Oh, the camera won't actually let me turn around. So there definitely is some kind of fixed camera. But still, this is really cool. I like this a lot. Okay, so this is, are we on an overworld of some kind? Because this is heavy heads. If I just go into here, and, oh, this reminds me of Spyro. So maybe there's like one, like there's an overworld like this, and then in the overworld there are certain levels you can enter, and you have to defeat those levels to get farther into the overworld. That would make sense. Oh yeah, we're back down the zero coins. Okay. Hmm. So I can hit this thing. Last time I did this, something happened, and this time something happens. This is so cool. Okay, so we'll get up here. And, oh, these coins are like invisible. Hmm. I wonder, do we have to find? Whoa. Um. No, I pressed the wrong button. Did I? Or did I not? Okay, so there's a gem, oh, you know what, I activated that. Did I? Weird, whoa, okay, these are bouncy, whoa. So what are these crystals? I don't know, but I got one. Oh, they give me 50, cool. Oh gosh, no, I missed one, I missed one, I missed one. Now I'm like gonna be freaking out trying to get every single coin, but oh, I can get up here, no problem. And that just gives me five. So I wonder if it will be judging me on how many coins I get. I sort of hope not, because I feels like it might be a bit of a challenge, but I. Sometimes you just need a challenge. But we've been playing a lot of 3D platformers on the channel recently, of course. We've been playing Mario Odyssey. Oh gosh, you guys are bad guys. Oh, get out of here. We've been playing Mario Odyssey. We have been playing, we played through A Hat in Time. This is just yet another one. I know uh, Sonic Forces just came out as well, and I don't know if I plan on playing that, but right now maybe we just enjoy the game we are playing. Is this a bag of coins? You bet it is. Cool. So this doesn't feel like a traditional 3D platformer. It feels a little bit more on rails. I mean, if I were to compare it to anything, maybe not the best comparison. Oh, Mittens tells us to follow the path of discipline, but he keeps glancing at his phone. Oh. <laughs> Youth these days, always looking at their phone. Whoa. What did that do? Oh, it just gave me more coins, okay. Um, it reminds me of Croc, if you guys have ever played the PlayStation 1 game Croc. Very familiar to that. So these are also coins. Everything is coins in this game. Interesting. But Lucky is super duper cute. But I don't know if he's been on his own adventures before or not. I don't know what's with like this upstream of wind, if I can hop into that. Oh, hello, Mittens. Lucky, Papa Jinx has commanded me to destroy you. An exceedingly simple task, if I'm honest. Yeah. However, the Mushu arts require I offer a series of tests before we may fight. First, prove yourself worthy by walk waking the great golem behind these gates. Until that time, I vanish. <laughs> All right, see ya. I like it, he's like an honorable martial artist. Even his enemies deserve some respect and honor. Okay, so, there we go. So I'm gonna guess it's probably quite simple. We gotta go through each world, defeat each cat, boss, and then defeat the bad guy at the end. But you know what, sometimes I like a nice and simple game. That can be fun. I did see an invisible coin, but now I no longer see it. Okay, it's gone. <laughs> I have no idea where I went. So we're out of here. I really hope I don't have to find every single coin. But uh, you never know, you never ever know. All right, break that, and ooh, okay. Oh wow, that's the goal, I guess, he's way over there. This game's really pretty though, I really like it. It's only on PC and Xbox right now. Okay, these guys aren't bad, guys, I keep beating them up, I'm awful. Um, but yeah, it's only on Windows 10, it's not even on Steam right now. Wow, you're a guardian. Mittens broke my body and now I'm stuck here, can you help? Oh, <laughs> Mittens, I guess, can still be a bit of a jerk, he is a bad guy. I must ring the bell to wake the great golem, but I am merely ahead. My spare body waits by the bell. If you can get me there, I can try to wake him. Oh, can we pick you up? Uh, X, yep, I can. Can I still spin? I can still spin. So I still have, oh, I can't jump. Ah, okay, so let me get you over here so that we can do other things. But oh, we need multiple heads, don't we? Looks like it. Okay, uh, oh, what's this gonna do? Just gonna wake him up, hey buddy, wake up. Oh, hi, how are you? Annoyed. Wait a minute, my brothers have no heads. I can't wake him alone. Can you find the rest of us? I'll try, looks like we need two more, not four more, or three more, or whatever. <laughs> whatever number more I, I thought we needed, we did not need. Oh, L, for lucky, ah, okay, so, wow, that brings me back. I haven't seen the collect the letters of your character's name since like, what, like Donkey Kong? What else, get, what other game had that? I know that, <laughs> That Tarzan game for the PlayStation also, a lot of old platformers did, so I'm guessing this right here was a checkpoint. I thought I saw some stuff behind us that I can't quite reach yet, maybe I will later. But cool, uh, we can collect the, the character, the, the, the letters of Lucky's names, or Lucky's name, he only has one. 
All right, let's get over here. Oh, darn it. But of course, if you do want to see more episodes than just one, what is that doing? Oh, oh, okay. It's a little bit of a challenge. Color coins. Whoa. Oh. Okay, so I could just jump right out of the dirt. Pretty cool. Whoa. And I get a chest which has another diamond in it. But if you do want to see more episodes. Oh, did we get a clover? Oh, I think I get it. So there's like four clovers in this level, as you can see on the top right. One of them I get by getting a certain amount of coins. I guess the threshold for this one was 300. There's another one I get for getting all of the lucky letters, and then there's another one I get that's a mystery, and then I guess another one we get that is just completing the level. Oh, what is this? Oh, is this a bonus area? This has like everything I like about old school platformers. Oh, this is really fun. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. We get across to here. Oh, oh. oh gosh, hey, we, we were fighting him already? Hold on, hold on. Oh, it was all an illusion. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh gosh, okay, so yeah, this is a bit of like a gauntlet or something, I don't really know. Okay, excuse me, pardon me, gotcha. Cool, let's break this a little bit, ooh. So we got a bunch of coins here, and ooh, this is the bonus way. The double jump isn't the best, like, I, I think the controls are actually pretty all right so far. I don't like the second jump, it's a little weak, it doesn't have much feeling, but we get the C for that, so we got, Ellen scene. So we need three more letters. Okay, that's cool. That wasn't the little bonus thing I thought it might have been in the top right, the little question mark clover. But I guess we've already gotten one clover. Okay, so wait, where are we now? Oh, we're over here now. Okay. Um, it would be good if I could turn my camera around, seeing how there is stuff behind me, but once again with the fixed camera, they just don't let you. Like this is the farthest I can turn, which I don't really like. I feel almost like I have like blinds on. Which you know what? That's about horses, not zebras. Um, okay, so what can I do here? It looks like I can do that and open up this little cage. Hey, you leave me alone, Mr. B. I don't, I, oh, there we go. I guess we can defeat enemies by hitting them with our talent. That is just for, um, what's it called? That is just for stunning them, which is interesting. All right, so we got head two out of three, and hopefully we can find more letters, but I feel like I need to explore the previous area a tiny bit more. Hooray! Okay, they're gonna show us another cutscene of him hit button the bell. Now, I could have done that myself. I have a tail. Oh, his eyeball. He has mostly vision, but not entirely. Wait a minute, my brothers have no head. I know. I, I'm already doing that. Uh. Oh, yeah, there's plenty more here. Wait, did these coins respawn? I swear I got these already. Maybe I didn't. Um, all right, excuse me. Ah, B, stop it. <laughs> I don't know how that didn't hit me. Oh, I can't get him. Oh, um, I mean, I don't think it's a big deal if I can't defeat the enemy, but at the same time, oh, that is some weird depth perception there. I was actually a little bit difficult. I did get some coins out of it, which at this point, I don't know how important or not important that is, so let's go to the right a bit more. Well, I guess there isn't too much to the right to do. Oh, wow, That whoa, that's how we get moving. Hey, okay, finding out those speedrun strategies, how quickly we can move. Oh, I really like that. Okay, so we can we can press the dive button and then when we're in the air, dive again, and it sort of makes a, you know, a different kind of move. What is this doing? Oh, um, we got you. No, wait, it's gone. Oh, I only have so much time to do it, huh? Okay, hit this, already hit it. Go like that, plop down here, grab the Yoon. And there we go, we just need the Y now. Well, the Y is quite clear, we need to save the world. <laughs> okay, not that kind of Y. Oh, so for getting all the coins, I get more coins. It's so weird how that works, but we've gotten a lot of them at this point. And this thing, uh, oh, okay. So last time we did that, it gave us coins. It doesn't seem to have any specific purpose. Instead, you know, you hit that and something happens. So if we any, see any kind of like, anything out of the ordinary, either it's floating or glowing, just hit it with your tail. And whoa. Okay, ooh, it's another time thing. We have a bunch of colored coins again. Oh, I was hoping I'd jump off that a little bit higher. Oh geez, once again with the depth perception, I think we're gonna wanna have to pay attention to Lucky's tail quite a lot. Oh gosh, that is really tough. Oh, did we get it? We got a clover, okay, cool. So did we get all of them? I'm gonna assume so. <laughs> it was sort of hard to tell, but we get ourselves the question mark clover. Cool. So we're just looking for the Y, and then I guess to complete the level, and then we're good to go. Cool. I really like that, that's actually really fun. 
It's sort of like, you know, a collectathon like Mario 64 or something where you have these, you know, obvious objectives, but they're not exactly the only objective. Like, after I get all the clovers here, I think I'm actually good to actually fight the, the boss, but I don't think that's it. I think I can actually get more levels done. That's pretty interesting. I mean, maybe that's not the case at all. <laughs> maybe I'm supposed to get everything here. But I'm just trying to look for the Y. Oh. Hey, the two for one. Cool. Let's grab all of this. Oh, there you go. And break you. But what are you gonna do? Ooh. Interesting. But I still don't see a Y. I mean, maybe there's more to the level, but I just had a feeling I'd find it around here. Hmm. It's interesting how much of the terrain you wouldn't think you'd be able to platform on, but you can. I'm trying to see, like, maybe there's some secret ways I can get up. But, oh, there it is! It's right in front of my face! Ready? Why? So there is our lucky club. Oh, leave me alone! Leave me alone! <laughs> what is that doing? I don't know. It was, I think it was maybe giving me more coins. We have 500 of them. Okay. Cool. It definitely is like Mario Odyssey so far with all the coins you get. I mean, we actually have lives in this game though, so that's a bit different. Okay, this is so much fun, I actually really like this. Oh, I have hands. I have multiple hands. Uh, now what? I don't know, he seems happy. <laughs> he shrugged, he's like, what do you want me to do? I don't know, <laughs> I'm not an actor. Okay, see, he just gave us a clover, okay, cool. Thank you, Mr. Golem guy. I woke you up from your internal slumber. I guess you aren't that much, I mean, I guess you are a funny, fine, a morning person. You were, you were friendly. So there we go, we do get a little animation for it. <laughs> That's cool, so we got ourselves another clover. So we have four in total now. And if I wanted, I could just get one clover by just rushing through that level. Four out of 99, so if we keep finding four per level, there's, there's quite a lot of levels to get to. Cool. So yeah, it looks like we could actually get head right on over and do it. Some extra stuff now. Golem getaway is now, isn't that what we just did? Uh, No, we did heavy heads. Okay, so there's more than one level we can do right now. All right, do you have anything to say? Uh, greetings, Lucky. Everybody's so happy, even in this, you know, weird book world. What is this doing? Uh, Camera's moving itself, I ain't doing anything. I don't know what that did, but we'll find out eventually. <laughs> I don't know if it was trying to show me something. Like, I did not touch anything on the controller there. I just sort of let it do its thing. That was weird. Okay, so I'm getting some extra coins and the diamond. I can't wait to find out what we're spending our coins on, but for right now, just a bit of a mystery. Can take and get even more of them though. Like, I'm sure maybe there's like some power-ups, maybe even some like extra like abilities that we could get. That sounds like it'd be possible. I mean, the game, like, it's not striking me as something that's gonna be super duper difficult, but we're so glad you're here, Lucky. I hear good things. If you're half the guardian your sister is, we're in good hands. Cool. So let's go into Golem Getaway. I guess maybe the Golem isn't a good guy if he's getting away? Or maybe we're the bad guy and we're trying to, you know, hold down a Golem. Come on. Whoa. Yeah, come on, I'm going. Oh, wow, it's like a four side scrolling section. Interesting, 2.5D. I train here and miss these grinding gears and spiky things as Mewshu demands a life or death consequence at every turn. This will be a good test for you. Good luck finding your way, people. Until then, I vanish. I like him, he's pretty cool. See ya. <laughs> so this area is looking a little bit more dangerous. Hello, you don't have anything to say? You got some popcorn. You just look like you're gonna have some fun watching. Okay. Um, oh, I gotta be careful for these platforms. I can only land on them once before they become deadly. Okay. This guy, th these guys are so silly. They're just always sitting here laughing. All right. Well, let's see if we can't get another 500 coins. We're definitely gonna need a, a lot of them. Oh, no! Okay, there you go. At least I got a couple of those. But definitely, it didn't seem to have like some kind of coin counter. So it doesn't seem like I need to get every coin, but I certainly need to get a lot of them if I want to get full completion. Which, you know, so far that doesn't seem too challenging, so I'll give it my best shot. Ooh, I found a secret. Um, hi, oh, hey, <laughs> thanks, uh, I guess. There's some big mean caterpillars up there. Uh, cool, a little crazy. Okay, land on your head, land on your head. That bat up there is part of the background. Oh, I can't pick up these coins because they're in the background. I can't move forward or back, I can only move left and right. I also don't like that we can't move with the D-pad, it's joystick only. That's not really all that good, there's no need for that. Whoa. Oh, sorry. 
Oh no, I just can knock them off, I'm awful. I don't mean to be mean, I thought you'd give me coins. So I don't know what the fastest way to move it. It would be cool if there was like a run button, but like I said, if maybe we can spend these coins on upgrades. Ooh, what is this little gem? Just more coins. So we need to beat you up so that you can drop that C, or I can just pick it up like that. I can see how that can work. Oh, nice, okay, that was better. Whoa, 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 I went a little farther than I expected. Land on your head. I don't see any more like hidden invisible areas. A and RT, that's gonna do my slam. So do that, ooh. Okay. Um. Oh hey, look at me, I'm in the background. Cool, so this is like Donkey Kong. It also definitely feels at times, especially in the 2D you know, platforming sections like this, it does sort of have like a Donkey Kong Country Returns feel. Okay, there we go. I feel like his double jump is a little bit better here in the 2D section, but maybe I'm wrong. I love these, oh no, I died! Oh, I fell for a while, dude. Oh no! So that's what it's like to die, okay. <laughs> that's what it, that's experience even in real life. Um, so I gotta do a lot of that over. Do I keep my coins? I actually don't know. I don't know how many coins I had before. Weird, okay. Is this stuff back though? Did I miss out on some secrets here? I would really hope not, but that might be the case. I mean, I haven't gotten a single um clover yet. Now let's slam that, and then do the same thing we did before. Uh, Like this. But maybe it's just a matter of it hasn't popped up yet? No, wait, okay, there we go, there we go. I was getting worried about it. Not the case sound. There definitely are a lot of coins that sort of just showed up. I don't know if they showed up because I died. There we go, See, that one's not too bad. This one's a little bit weird though. Ooh, there we go, okay, I'm doing it a bit better. Come on. It's just a little bit scary at times, this platform. Come on, I just need to get this last coin. Awesome, I got it, just barely. And we get the K for that. So we're already three letters in. This level might be a bit shorter. Whoa, or maybe I'm just getting a bit better. Ooh, one of the two, one of the two. So there's that done. Get another checkpoint for me. There are multiple ways to go here, and I'm not really liking it. It's a little scary. Oh, he just gives me coins for showing up. <laughs> He's like, hey, you found me. Here's some coins. Hmm, oh, there's an extra life. I could use that, because I've gotten my booty kicked. Well, why am I following you around? Maybe not, maybe he doesn't give me coins, or maybe he does. I don't know, maybe he just doesn't like me. Maybe I smell really bad. Why is there more than one path here? I don't really understand. Like, it makes me think maybe there's a secret around here that I'm missing, but it looks pretty blatant to me. I don't really see anything. Oh gosh, this is one of the twisty turning platforms. Gotta be careful. Where am I going? Up here? Oh, oh, oh I have to hit him. Is that the idea? I didn't want to hit him. He's not that bad. Oh, we do get a little bit of a oomph to our jump down if we do a, do a little bit of a spin. See, that time I hit him. Oh, okay, I feel like I might have missed out on some stuff then. I'm a little nervous, I might have to play through this again. But there we go, we got ourselves a little question mark Glover just by hitting him. Interesting, so hit things. <laughs> I already established that in the last level, but I, I have to reestablish it, I guess. Hit everything with your tail. Hmm, let's uh, hit you, there we go. I mean, the enemies, if we could take care of them by jumping on their heads, I might as well, right? Oh geez, all of these platforms are the, the evil kind of platforms. Whoa, I'm up here now. Um, oh, look at that, so once again, it was 300 coins. I wonder if it'll ever change, or if it'll always be 300. I don't know what'll get more difficult. Will it be the fact that, um, oh boy. Will it be the fact that we have to get more coins, or that there will be less of them? All right, so I am missing out on getting coins now, but I'm not exactly stressed out about it as long as we're not missing any um, letters, because how many letters do I have? Is there any way to check? Oh, no, I didn't want to do that. Okay, get back in there. Hmm, I guess there might not be a way to check how many uh, letters I have. Just, just pressing different buttons, trying to figure it out. Ooh, oh, whoa, whoa, okay, be careful here, here's why. Oh no, why did I do that? Oh, hey, that hit me, weird. Okay, so that's why, now we just need L. I hope I haven't, oh no, I missed L. Oh no, I'm taking an L. <laughs> that stinks, oh gosh. So I missed L somewhere in that little area. That was definitely a shorter level though, I think. It felt like it. Weird. Hmm. 
Wonder where, where it could have been. Probably right in front of my face, I just totally missed it. So seven out of 99 instead of eight out of 99, he shit's embarrassing. I thought I was a 3D platforming master, I guess none. We can always go back, like I said, if you guys support this episode, you know, maybe we will play more and maybe we will, uh, no. Maybe we'll end up, um, Lord Ember's domain. Yeah, how is that a golem getaway? What, what golems were getting away there? <laughs> I'm not really sure. But maybe we'll play more episodes of this. Maybe we'll actually do a full playthrough. I'd love to hear your thoughts. But um, we don't have too much time in today's episode. I don't think we have enough time to do another level. But uh, what we could do is we could just explore this area a little bit. Um, get a better feel for the overworld. Uh, hello. Almost there. My brother and I used to switch heads to confuse our mom. She always saw right through it. Moms are smart, yes they are. They're wonderful. Okay, so we'll just adventure this area a little bit. Maybe that'll be a little bit more fun. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> it's all fun so far. That's why I'm considering you know, playing more of it. But, just for right now, because we only have a couple minutes left of this episode. But yeah, this is only one of the couple games releasing recently. Um, I'm definitely, like, if we don't do a series on this, don't spread it, because there are some other games coming up that I will be doing. Ah, series is on. Um, some of which are Mario Party the Top 100. We're gonna be playing the new Pokemon game. We're gonna be playing the new Lego Marvel. Lots of cool games coming out this month. It is definitely not a dull month. I know the new Sonic game came out just the other day. A lot of people have been asking if I'm gonna be playing it. Am I going the wrong way? I think I can't continue because I haven't. Or no, I can just go this way. <laughs> but um, a lot of people have been asking if I'm gonna be playing the Sonic game. I do want to, but I don't plan on what is this. I do plan on it, but I do want to, but I don't plan on it just because I haven't gotten a copy of the game yet. And obviously, it's expensive to buy all these games, so usually sometimes I have to rely on the developers or the publishers sending me a copy of them. And I, I was in talks of maybe getting something like that, but they haven't gotten back to me, so I'm not really sure. So you found me, about time. What's going on with my outfit? Here's the deal. I don't like clovers. Then why do you wear them? I love them! Oh, you got me. Or I did, I might even have too many, honestly. Kinda like eating candy all day, not so great. Maybe I could part with a few and prove your commitment. Okay, here's a puzzle. Probably too tough for you. Swipe those foxes in the glowing spaces, see if you can. What is this, like a game of whack-a-mole? Um, okay. Wait. What? Wait, what? I, I just don't understand. I have to whack the foxes. Stump, not surprised you're looking you're looking at a master puzzle. Like, give up. The springboard in the back is a leap of shame going. It's easy. Wait, wait. I don't understand. Oh, now it's working. Oh, wait. Where am I supposed to? Am, am I supposed to hit these into each other? Is that the idea? Or into the plus marks? Okay. I think I can do that. Um, I bet you if I go like this, actually, I can knock this one back. Knock this one, okay, yeah, this ain't too bad. Making fun of me for dropping out to figure it out. I can figure it out, I just didn't understand what I was supposed to do. Okay, I still have no idea how I'm gonna spend my coins. I was hoping I could figure that out in this uh, episode, but hey, maybe if we play more, we find out. It does definitely seem like there's only one clover to find in this level, so I'm glad I found it. Cool. Okay, so what is that gonna do? That is gonna open up another one, left control. Um, oh no, I guess it, uh, it forgot uh, I was using controller there. Okay, so we'll finish up with that. That is our look at Lucky's, or was it? Super Lucky's Tale, that's what it is. Very cool little game, maybe we'll play more, maybe we won't, might be up to you. Let me know in the comments section below if you'd like to see more of Super Lucky's Tale, but for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode on Super Lucky's Town. If you watch this part of the video, make sure you comment Lucky Zebra so that you've watched at the end and that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.